it had been here, letting them hear what the Spirit said unto the churches. The book of Ephesians, chapter 1 and verse 3. In the book of First Peter, chapter two and verse nine. Ephesians chapter one, verse three. First Peter chapter two and verse nine. Reading first from the book of Ephesians. Chapter 
do not understand or appreciate the significance of being chosen by God and numbered among the blessed people. Anyone hear me now? Amen. There are some folk who don't understand that and don't appreciate that. Yeah. What it means to be numbered among the blessed people. Mm -hmm. They take it for granted because they don't understand how unique this blessing is. Therefore, they don't experience the great joy of the chosen. Someone hear me now? Amen. Amen. The great joy of the chosen. Amen. When you're chosen and you know you're chosen, that should bring you joy. Amen. 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 A kind of joy that the world can't give you. Yes. And the world can't take from you. It's a kind of joy the world doesn't even understand. Yes. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. When they come to understand the greatness of the blessing, then they will experience the greatness of the joy. Amen. Amen, Amen somebody. Mm -hmm. The blessed people are a special people who will spend eternity with God. Yes. In heaven. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With joy and peace forever. Yes, amen. Amen. Isn't that a blessing? Amen. Yes, it is. Isn't that something to look forward to? Yes. Show one tell you thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. They look forward to that. Joy and peace. Mm -hmm. Those who know that they are numbered among the blessed people have an abiding joy in their heart. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. I'll say that again. Those who know that they are numbered among the blessed people, they have an abiding joy in their heart. Yes. Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. There are those who are called by God, but are not chosen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Do you see that? Amen. Amen. There are those who are called, but not chosen. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, many are called, but only a few are chosen. Yes. Are you hearing that? Amen. Mm -hmm. The blessed people are called and chosen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Somebody tell Amen. me thank you. Thank you, Jesus. I say the blessed people are called and chosen. These are the blessed people <laughs> that were chosen by God mm -hmm. before he even made the world. Yes. Amen. Somebody tell me thank you. Thank you, thank you Jesus. Mm-hmm. If you were with those blessed people, he knew you, the Bible said, for you. Mm -hmm. And then he chose you to be his. Amen. When? Before he made the world. Yes. Somebody tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. They were chosen to be holy. You were chosen to be holy. Amen. Somebody. Amen. Amen. They were chosen to be holy. They were predestinated. Their destiny was predetermined. They were predestinated to be conformed to the image of his son. That is, God chose you mm -hmm. for you to be like Jesus. Yes. Is there one here now? Amen. And if you are like Jesus, consider yourself blessed because you are numbered among the blessed people. 
Because everyone does not have that same testimony that you have. Yes. God gives his chosen people a willing heart. Yes, sir. Amen. To love him. Yes. And to obey him. Yes, it is. God gives them that heart. Amen. Yes, Yes, if you're a witness, you can say something. Yes. Amen. If it's Amen. true, you can say something. Amen. Bear witness to the truth. Amen. 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 If God does not call a person, that person will never come to him. Uh -uh. Amen. 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 Somebody. Amen. If God does give a person of willing heart. He will not refuse God's voice, but he will obey God and he will love God. Amen. But if God does not call a person, are you listening? Amen. He will never come to him. If God does not give a person a willing heart, he will not love God. And he will not obey God. Amen. 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 If God does not give a person a willing heart, that person will not love God. And that person will not obey God. Yes. Amen. In John chapter 10, verse 28 and 29, Jesus said, my sheep hear my voice. Are you hearing me? And I know them. And they follow me. Amen. Somebody say thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. He goes on to say, and I give unto them eternal life. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. And they shall never perish. Are you listening? <laughs> yes. Amen. They shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. Lord, I thank you. Thank you, Jesus. He said, my father, which gave them me, he is greatest, he is greater than all. Amen. Amen. And no man is able to pluck them out of my father's hand. Amen. Someone tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. The chosen people are, are given a mind by God. Are y'all hearing me? Mm -hmm. yeah. The chosen people are given a mind by God to prove to themselves that they are called and chosen. Yes. Prove it to yourself. Mm -hmm. Amen. 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 No one knows like you know. Prove to yourself that you're called and chosen. Amen. 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 The chosen people measure themselves the chosen people measure themselves by the word of God. Yes. To see if they are conformed mm -hmm. to the image of his son. Yes. Amen. You measure yourself by the word of God. Amen. The chosen people do not see themselves as under construction. <laughs> you don't even have to do that. Yes. Amen. Amen. A lot of folk are saying that they, they're full of saying that they're under construction. The chosen people don't say that. They don't say they're under construction. Because under construction implies that the person is aware mm -hmm, of some blemish or some defect mm -hmm. in his life. Amen. 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 Somebody. Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, the church that Jesus is coming back for is a holy church without blemish and without spot or wrinkle. That church is not under construction. When he comes, he's going to find the church that's been washed out of the water of the word. 
Amen. Amen. The church that is clean, holy, and without blemish. Someone's going to thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In fact, he's coming back for a blessed people. To those who are numbered among the blessed people. Somebody yes. says, God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. The chosen people have no secret sins or no unknown sins. Well, you hear me, do you? Amen. I'll say it again for somebody who might be listening someplace. The chosen people have no secret sins. The chosen people have no unknown sins. Mm -hmm. If a person is aware of sin in his life, mm -hmm. he's guilty before God. Amen. Amen. I'll say that again. If you are aware of sin in your life, mm -hmm. then you are guilty in the sight of God. Yes, Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. And you are not ready for heaven. Someone will tell God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Mm -hmm. If a person is not aware, if a person is not aware of a sin in his life, he is not guilty before God. Amen. Someone tell him, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. A chosen person makes sure that his conscience is clear. Mm -hmm. And that there is nothing in him that is not like Jesus. Yes. Somebody tell him thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Jesus. A chosen person walks before God with a clear conscience. Mm -hmm. And day by day he lives, he lives his life in such a way that he can say that there is nothing in him that's not in Jesus. Yes, Lord. Are y'all hearing me? Yes. Mm-hmm. The thing here is not like Jesus. The chosen people are predestinated mm -hmm. to be reformed to the image of the Son of God. Whatever is in Jesus will also be in the chosen people. Amen. Can anyone tell you thank you? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Whatever is in Jesus will also be in you. Yes. In you, Amen. Because you are predestinated to be conformed to his image. Tell him thank you, somebody. Thank, thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Mm -hmm. They are aware, the chosen people are aware of the exceeding greatness and precious promises that God has given them. Mm -hmm. Some folk don't even know what God promised them. Lord Jesus. Mm -hmm. For those who have chosen, you ought to know. Amen. You ought to understand. You ought to be aware of the exceeding great. Yes. And precious promises that God mm -hmm. has given you. Yes. yes. This awareness is the source of your unshakable joy. Mm hmm a joy that's in you that the world didn't give you and nothing in this world can take it away from you. Yes. Amen. You have joy when you're up. You have joy when you're down. Amen. You have joy on the mountain. Yes, Jesus. You have joy in the valley. Yes. You have joy when you're sick. You have joy when you're well. Mm -hmm. A deep down joy that have nothing to do with the condition that you're experiencing now. Yes. yes. Amen. But you have joy because of what you're looking forward to. Amen. You don't hear me, do you? Amen. Yes. I'm sick of the joy. Those who are numbered among the blessed will endure any trial. Mm -hmm. Y'all hear me? Yes. In a trial, to go through in his suffering. Amen. They will bear in their hardship mm -hmm. to please God. Yes. yes. Are you hearing what I'm 
strength. Amen. I hope you got that kind of mind. Amen. If you are numbered among the chosen people, you have a mind to go through any trial. Yes, Lord. Any suffering. Any hardship. Mm -hmm. For the glory of God. Amen. Yes, amen. Amen, son. Yes. Amen. You don't back up. Because if it's hard, Amen. you go forward. Yes, Lord. And that glorifies you. Amen. Let me thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Because God has chosen you to glorify Him. Mm -hmm. You're glorifying just in the sun to shine. Yes, mm -hmm. Amen. You're also glorifying when mm -hmm. the storm comes. Yes, Lord. Amen. You don't just glorify him on the mountain. Yes, sir. You also praise him in the valley. Yes, sir. Can I get a witness? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. You don't just praise him when things are going all right. You also praise him when things are going all wrong. Amen. Amen. So we're tell God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Because you realize that God chose you. To praise him. That's what he chose you for. Yes. To praise him. Because he is satisfied. When he see you patiently endure. Mm. Whatever comes upon you. Amen. For his glory. Amen. Yes. Patiently endure it. For what? To glorify my God. Yes. yes. Someone let them thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Tell Take anything that's thrown at you. Take it. Go through it. Endure it. Amen. For what? To glorify my God. Yes. Why? He called me to, to glorify him. Amen. Amen. Not just when I'm up, but also when I'm down. So I'm yes. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. That is a significance of being numbered among the blessed people. Amen. Amen. Because first of all, they are numbered among them who are chosen mm -hmm. by God Himself to be saved. Amen. Amen. God chose you, blessed person. Amen. God chose you to be saved. Amen. And there is no power in the universe that can make God change His mind. Oh, Jesus. I don't care how you have to cry, hmm. or how sick you are, how much pain you're in. Yes, Lord. That does not make God change his mind about you. Yes. So therefore you praise him in the hard times, you praise him in the good times. Why? Because he's still there. Yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. God chose these blessed people for eternal an eternal destiny that is sure. Mm -hmm. God knows where you hit. Yes, he does. And if you are a blessed person and you know your heart is right with God, you know where you hit it all. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Because God made you a promise. Thank you, Lord. And God will never go back on his word. So I'm going to try to thank you. Thank, thank you, Jesus. Jesus. God determined your your eternal destiny. When? Before the foundation of the world. Yes. Tell me what power. Thank you, Jesus. Tell me what power can change that. Yes. If God predetermined it, it can't be changed. Amen. Amen. I don't care what the devil does to you. Mm. You're going to end up holy. Yes. yes. You're going to end up holy. Oh, yeah. You might fall, but you won't stay down. Amen. Amen. You don't like that, do you? Yes, Lord. Because some folk think that good folk can't have a problem. Sometimes good folk do have problems. Amen. Amen. But what happens Amen. when things go wrong? He makes it right. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. 
Although you fall, mm -hmm. you got a mind not to stay down. Man. You can't be satisfied in a backslidden condition. Jesus. Your mind is troubled. Your heart is troubled. You can't be satisfied until you know that everything is all right between yes, you and your Savior. Jesus. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. Oh, you might lose the battle. You're not going to lose the war. Amen. Amen. Because God is able to pick you up. Yes, he is. You don't hear me now, do you? Yes. yes. He's able to turn you around. Yes. Amen, somebody. Amen. Yes, Oh, the devil thinks he has you because they <laughs> made you lose the battle. Yes, Lord. But look at that chosen person. Yes. On his knees, repenting to God. Yes. Saying, God, you help me. Thank you, Jesus. God, you strengthen me. Yes. God, you hold me. Don't let me go. I want to live right. Yes, yes Lord. I want to be holy. There's something within me. That makes me want to be holy. Mm -hmm. What is that? Thank That's the grace of God that He gave you before He even made the world. So yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Jesus said that He would give the chosen people. You hear me? Amen. He said He would give them eternal life. That's what yes. Jesus said. Yes, He did. And. Jesus said that no one is able to pluck them out of this hand. Yes. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. Jesus said, eventually, you are going to win. Amen. Why? Isn't there something in you that tells you that you just somehow, some way, got to keep on keeping up. Yes. 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 Is there something within you that one song said that's holding the rain? Amen. Something within you that won't let you be satisfied. Yes, Lord. Until you know that God is satisfied with you. Yes. yes. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. I'm talking about being numbered among the blessed people. Yes. Those who are numbered among the best people have an inheritance. Are you hearing me? Yes. An inheritance incorruptible. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. And undefiled. Mm -hmm. And that faded not away. Yes, Jesus. Where is it? It's reserved in heaven for who? For you. Amen. Blessed person. Amen. You know why? Because you're holy. Yes, thank you. Jesus. Uh -huh. Amen. And the devil said, did not lock you down? <laughs> hmm. You say, yeah. Uh huh. Will you pick me back up? Look at that. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Uh -huh. Amen. Didn't that make you weak? Uh -huh. Yeah, you did. Yes. But he came, he came along and gave me strength. Yes. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Weren't you almost gone? Yes, I was, but he came along and revived me again. Yes. So I want to tell God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Why did God, why did God do it? Because you are numbered among the chosen Amen. people. Yes. You want to tell God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Give a mind to live right. Yes, Lord. You want to shout hallelujah right now? Hallelujah. Everyone thank, you. Have that thank you. You are blessed by God to have that mind. Yes. And that's your assurance that you're going to make it. Keep asking God, keep me with the mind. Yes. Keep me with the mind. Why? Temptations, trials, Amen. troubles. Amen. They come against you to shake you up mm -hmm. and make you change your mind about God. Jesus. The devil is alive. Yes, Amen. Amen. You understand what's he understand what's going on. Yes. When the storm comes, understand what's going on. And if I can just make it through the storm, I'll be alright. Mm -hmm. But how are you gonna make it? Yes. 
Because the one who chose me, he's going to hold me up. Yes, he is. When the wind is blowing. Thank you. When the pillows are rolling, he's going to hold me up. He'll give me strength when I get weak. Thank you, Jesus. Amen, somebody. I'll have joy when I should have sorrow because of him. Amen. So I'm going to tell God, thank you. Amen. Thank God for the inheritance that we have. It's in reservation. Amen. For who? For us. Yes. Tell him, thank you because you have a reservation in heaven. Yes. yes. Amen, somebody. Yes. I go to prepare a place for you. Yes. Can I get a witness? Amen. In my father's house, there are many mansions. Amen. Yes. And I'm going to prepare a place for you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. You were there when he said that. Yes. But if you're if you're numbered among the chosen people, yes. he was still talking to you. Yes, he was. I'm going to heaven. I'm going to my father's house. But they are going to mention them. I'm going to prepare a place for you. And I'm going to make a reservation for you. Yes. Amen, somebody. Amen. I'm going to give you an inheritance that's incorruptible and undefiled and that faded not away. Yes. It's going to be reserved in heaven for you. Amen. Whenever you get there. Yes, you don't hear me, do you? Amen. Whenever you get there. Your reservation is still good. Yes. Somebody tell them, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Whenever you get there. Thank you, Lord. Look on the road and say, I see your name here, that you are numbered among the blessed. Yes. Come, ye blessed of thy Father. Enter into the joy of the Lord. Thank you. That was prepared for you before the foundation of the world. Yes. And somebody wonder, what are we singing about? Mm-hmm. We sing it because we are number among the blessed people. Thank you, Jesus. What are we shouting about? What are you what are you dancing about? Because you know you are numbered among the blessed people. Yes. yes. That makes your feet get light sometimes. Amen. 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 Make you proud sometimes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank the Lord. Yes. And somebody wonder what was wrong with you. Yes. And you said to them, if you are blessed like I'm Jesus. Yes. You can't praise him because you don't have nothing to praise him about, but I do. Amen. Thank you, Amen. Because I can look back to where he brought me from. Yes. 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 I ask myself, why did he bring me from where I was uh -huh. to where I am? Thank you, Jesus. Why did my mind change? Yes. From the way it was. To the way it is. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. And then you read the scripture, the word of God, and you realize, oh, I see. Amen. He chose me. Yes. Mm -hmm. Before the foundation of the world. Yes, yes. yes. Thank you, Jesus. He predestinated me. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Are you hearing me? Amen. Well, he purposed. You have to hear me. Yes. He purposed to save me. Mm -hmm. None can defeat his purpose. Amen. Or turn back his outstretched hand. Yes. No one can separate me from his great love wherewith he loved me. Yes. And no one can pluck me out of his hand. Amen. That's why, Amen. through many dangerous towers and snares, yes. I have already come. Yes. How'd you make it? It was grace that brought me safe this spot. Yes, I thank you, Jesus. Thank you. And grace shall lead me home. Yes, Lord. Yes. Yes. Aren't you worried about it? No, I'm not worried about it. Thank you, Lord. Why aren't you worried about it? Because can't nobody pluck me out of his hand. Yes. yes. Someone tell God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Saints of God, you ought to have joy. Thank you, Lord. You ought to be glad. Aren't you glad for what he did for you? Yes. Is anybody here glad? Yes. I'm glad, I'm glad. 
Thank you, Jesus. For we did come. Thank you, Jesus. I'm glad they numbered me among them. Mm -hmm. Those are the church. Yes. yes. Thank you, Jesus. Those are blessed. Thank so you. I'm telling the Lord, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. The best people. The best people have learned not to hope in this world. Mm -hmm. You hear me? Amen. Amen. You should have heard the Sunday school lesson. Chosen people have learned not to hope in this world. Yes. Because if you hope in this world, your hopes might come to naught. Yes, Lord. Amen. 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 So he said, set your affections on things of love. Not. He did say it. Mm -hmm. Yes, he did. I don't care who don't, who don't want to preach it, who don't want to teach it, he did say it. Amen. If you are risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ sits on the right hand of God. Yes, Lord. Set your affections on, affections on things of love, not on things on the earth. He Amen. did say that to yes, us. He did. The chosen people. Yes. And when he said it, that made us glad. Amen. Amen. Anybody here glad? Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. I'm glad. I got joy. Amen. Amen. And I tell the Lord, I'm glad for what you did for me. Yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he's done for me, what happened? My soul cries out. Hallelujah for what? Thank I thank Amen. God for saving me. Yes. Amen. He didn't save everybody. <laughs> but he numbered me among the chosen. Thank you. Somebody tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Well, the best people have much more than this world could ever offer them. Mm -hmm. You didn't hear me Amen. Amen. I say it again. The blessed people, those who are numbered among the blessed people, mm -hmm. they have much more than this world could ever offer them. Are you hearing me now? Yes, sir. That's why when the Lord Jesus Christ was in human flesh, and the devil thought he could take advantage of that humanity. So he said, if you fall down and wish with me, I give you all these kingdoms of the world and all the glory of them. That's what he said. That's what he told him. Jesus says no. But why not? I have something better than that. I'm looking forward to. If I can just hold out mm -hmm. until tomorrow. Look at this. If I can just keep the faith through the night. Amen. Everything's going to be all right. That's right. Amen. He'll come Amen. to you. Amen. And offer you something. You got to tell it all that. What you're offering me does not measure up to what God promised me. Amen. So I gotta turn you down and accept what he offered me. Yes, sir. And the devil said, Well, you go, you go, you gonna suffer. That's all right. You say not for long. Amen. Then you're gonna get sick. That's all right. I won't stay sick. He said, You're gonna die. I won't stay dead. Yes, Jesus. Someone tell about that. Thank, Thank you, Jesus. Are you hearing me? The best people. I hope you hear me. Somewhere. Hope somebody hear me. Those who are blessed by God. Those who are numbered among the blessed people. Yes, Jesus. Don't need this world to make them happy. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. Well, Velvet Man, I don't usually take so long, but you know the Lord 
comes with me. Amen. Amen. I, I've been sick, but I feel pretty good right now. Thank God. Amen. Thank God. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. I say again, the best people don't need this world to make them happy. Yes. Amen. 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 Do you think John the Baptist needed this world to make him happy? He was in the wilderness. Amen. Not at a hotel, he's out there in the wilderness. Amen. Yes, Lord Jesus. Dressed in what? Cow's hair with a Strip the skin tied around his waist for a belt. He wasn't out there looking for happiness. Mm -mm. He knew his happiness would come from some other source. Amen. Amen. Amen, somebody. Amen. I'm not depending on this world to find happiness. Yes. I might get sick in this world. Amen. I might cry mm -hmm. in this world. Amen. I might feel pain in this world. Mm -hmm. I might have sorrow and grief in this world. Yes, Jesus. So I cannot depend on this world for my happiness. Mm -hmm. I gotta get it from someplace else. Someone's gonna thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, I've learned. Now I'm gonna stop. The blessed people have learned something. They have learned that everything in this world is only temporary. Amen. 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 You didn't hear me, did you? Yes. Amen. Amen. Anyone heard me? The blessed people understand mm -hmm. that everything in this world is only temporary. Yes. yes. Why would I exchange the eternal for the temporary? Mm. So much to Thank you, Jesus. They have learned that they have a greater happiness beyond this world mm -hmm. than this world can even than this world can even imagine. Amen. Eyes haven't seen. You don't hear me, do you? Mm -hmm. Amen. Ears haven't heard and not even entered into the heart of man. What God has prepared for those who love Him. Amen. You can't even imagine Thank you, Lord. what God has for you. Mm -hmm. Why would you give it up? Amen. Why not just praise Him and say, Lord, I thank you for numbering me among the blessed people. Mm -hmm. Because everybody is not blessed like you blessed. Amen. Amen. You ought to say, thank you. Amen. Thank you. Mm -hmm. they, the blessed people, and I can tell you this, those who are numbered among the Bless you. Mm -hmm. We have lost the fear of death. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Yes. What did you say, preacher? I say we who are numbered among the blessed people have lost the fear of death. Yes. Most folk walk around in fear. Because they think they're going to die. Mm -hmm. And if they don't have Jesus, they are. Amen. But the blessed people, you know what you're saying? Mm -hmm. Amen. The blessed people have lost the fear of death. Why? They know that they have everlasting life. Yes. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Not the body. It goes back to the dust. Mm -hmm. Praise God. On that great day, you get a new body. Mm -hmm. Yes, amen. I can hear, I can hear it, amen. A body that doesn't get sick. Mm -hmm. A body that doesn't get old. <clears throat> a body that never experiences pain. Yes. yes. Uh-huh. And that body will be your body mm -hmm. in the world to come. Yes. yes. So death. It's not something that we fear because we have everlasting life. And Jesus said, 
we will never taste of death. Man. Oh, you didn't read that, did you? Did you read that? He said they will never taste of death. Yes. He said they will never perish. Amen. Didn't he say it like the witness? Yes. Amen. You want to read that beside me? He said they will never taste of death. Amen. Uh-huh. Meaning what? You won't even know when you transition from here to there. Amen. Amen. So what are you afraid of? Yes, Jesus. Because when you get there, Paul say, it's much better. Mm -hmm. Well, how did he know? He said, well, I know a man who was caught up in paradise. Mm -hmm. Amen. I, also, I know a man who was caught, caught up to the third heaven. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's how I know. Mm -hmm. He said, that's why I want, I want to depart and be with the Lord, which is what? Far better. Yes. I know it's far better. Why? Because I've seen it. Amen. Don't you all say that? Amen. Amen, somebody. Well, the joy of being numbered among the blessed people, we have a certain kind of joy. Are you with me? Mm -hmm. We have a certain kind of joy. Certain kind of assurance, a certain kind of madness. When you know deep down in your own heart that you are numbered among the blessed people. Amen. You hear me? Amen. I said, when you know deep down in your own heart. Mm -hmm. That you are numbered among the blessed people. Yes. Amen. Does that not bring you joy? Amen. Amen. Amen, somebody. Yes. Well, when Jesus says, only a few will find the right way, the way of life. Amen. You know what I mean? Yes. And then you find yourself numbered among the blessed people. And he's telling you that you have everlasting life. And he said only a few will find life. Amen. And you realize that you have life. Doesn't that bring you joy? Amen. Amen. Doesn't that make you glad? It should make you glad. If it does not make you glad, you must not have the right understanding. Somebody told you something that scared you. Mm -hmm. And the word told you something that made you, that should have made you glad. Yes. And took away the fear. But you've been programmed so much. Amen. Amen. To be so much like the world. Amen. And so unlike Jesus. Yes, Lord. Until you can even appreciate what God has for you. Mm -hmm. What God has done for you. Amen. It's an insult to God for you to live in fear when he has given you so much yes, to make you glad. Mm -hmm. Amen. So I want to tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Never, never perish and never, never taste of death. And only if you want to find this, The people who are blessed <coughs> are glad because they realize that they have found what Jesus said only a few would find. Yes, sir. Are you with me? Amen. He said only a few would find it. That's what he said. And you found it. Look at that. Why did you find it? Because he shows you. He said, you didn't choose me, I chose you. Amen. Amen. That's what he said. Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, certainly you didn't choose him before the foundation of the world. Mm -hmm. But he knew you. You say, well, I didn't exist then. Yes, you did. In the mind of God. Amen. In the plan of God. <laughs> that can't be changed. 
So he knew you. And he chose you to have life. And you have it. If you understand it and appreciate it. Amen. It should make you glad. It should give you joy. Amen. Can I have a witness? Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, since you knew your family, Jesus said, many are called, but few are chosen. Didn't you say that? Amen. Amen. The blessed people understand that they were called and chosen. Amen. And that brings them joy. Yes. Amen. Well, if you know that you were called, and you know that you were chosen, how do you know that you were chosen? Because you would have the mind that you have if you were not chosen. Somebody tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. I'm going to say I'm going to talk to you about. Mm -hmm. They are called and they are chosen, and that brings them joy. The best people have joy in knowing that they are loved by God. Does anyone here know that God loves you? Amen. Amen. Did he prove his love for you? But he chose you to be his own child? Yes. Amen. You are blessed and you have joy because you know God loves you. Amen. Not only does God love you, but you are also loved by all the other blessed people. Amen. Can I get a witness now? Amen. Amen. You are loved by all the other blessed people. And you love all the other blessed people. Amen. Amen. That's what God put in your heart. Amen. If you are not among the blessed. So I want to thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Well, I have to hurry along. Mm -hmm. The joy and happiness that belong to you, but deep down in your own heart, you know you're not going to the blessed. Deep down in your own heart, you know you have a promise from God, and no one can change that promise. That should bring you joy. Amen. 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 Well, when you know deep down in your heart that Jesus said that you'll never taste of death. That should bring you joy. When you know that deep down in your heart that Jesus promised you that you would never perish. Mm -hmm. Jesus promised it to you. Amen. Amen. Aren't you blessed? Amen. Aren't you blessed? Yes. So much to say amen. Amen. Hmm? When you realize that only a few are blessed like you, that should bring you joy because you are one among a few. Because only a few are going to find it. And you are numbered among those few. Don't you tell God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. When you realize that you really have a good reason. You have a good reason to thank and praise God. Yes, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. As for me, I have a great reason to thank and praise God. That's Amen. not all mm -hmm. Well, when I think about what he did for me, I have to say thank you. Amen. Amen. And when I realize what he gave to me, I have to be glad. Yes, I do. I have to have joy. Amen. I have to praise him. How can I help but say thank you? Mm -hmm. How can I help but say hallelujah? Amen. Because he chose me. Amen. And I know that I'm blessed. So I want to thank you. Thank you, Jesus. I hope that you appreciate that you are numbered among the blessed people. Amen. He that had it here, let him hear. But the Spirit saith unto the churches. 